Let's write three equivalent fractions for 6 eighteenths. And here's how we do it. We're trying to find other fractions that are equivalent. They have the same value as 6 divided by 18. You get the same decimal number. It's just that they're in a different form. They have a different numerator and denominator. Because 6 and 18 are even, let's just divide both of these by 2. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 18 divided by 2 is 9. So that's an equivalent fraction for 6 eighteenths. If you divide 6 by 18 or 3 by 9, you get the same decimal answer. We can even simplify this further. So 3 ninths, if we divide 3 by 3, that's 1. If we divide 9 by 3, that's 3. So we simplify it further to 1 third, and that is another equivalent fraction for 6 eighteenths. Let's take 6 eighteenths, and instead of dividing the numerator and denominator by 2, Let's multiply. 6 times 2, that equals 12. 18 times 2, that's 36. And 12 over 36, that's another equivalent fraction for 6 eighteenths. And for all of these, if you divide 6 by 18, 3 by 9, 1 by 3, or 12 by 36, you'll get the same decimal answer as they are equivalent fractions. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.